everyone welcome back to my youtube channel i got another video for you guys today i couldn't wait till next week to show you guys this but i was able to pick up myself a build and battle stadium uh for silver tempest i was able to get this pre-ordered from our local chapter store and i'm very excited to show you guys this so let's take a look at opening this pack let's start off with the four packs so you get four booster packs it looks like we got one of each art that's lovely hopefully we pull that off in our art lugia we get ourselves oh oh this is very interesting actually actually this is really cool okay s sorry about that i'm thrown off but our dice we got for like our damage counter as well as our dice usually i think it's just packaging a like a bag or something like that but interesting it's just sealed so i like that that's cool we get a load of energy luck relief energy let's go and what else did we get here oh okay so we got our like poison markers we get that and these are the two build and battle boxes that we get so that we get like two ready to play decks uh actually funny thing is me and my little uh my little brother over the weekend uh we played with some of our like lost origin ones and it's pretty neat because we we're able to uh just learn to play never really played the pokemon game or pokemon card game other than like tcg online but let's take a look at opening these guys up let's see which of the four pre-release decks that we were able to pull and i'm actually not sure what like the featured pokemons i think there's rapidash uh i think there's also curlia and i'm not sure who, what the other two are but hopefully we get the missing two that i'm i can't think of right now awesome awesome we'll slide these guys out over here let's rip it open we get ourselves Oh, speaking of Curlia, so we got the Curlia deck for one. Fingers crossed we get not the same one. Oh, okay, we get Archeops, if I pronounce that correctly. This one looks pretty cool. I believe this might be a playable deck, so that's going to be very exciting. I'll put these two to the side. And I believe we just get checklists over there for the packs. I'm just dumping everything everywhere on the floor, but another four packs here as well over here. We get another four packs, so we should have a total of 12 packs. I think we got one of each artwork actually as well. I love that. So that's a lot of packs to rip open today. Let's start getting into it. Start it over here. And let's start this with like a one pack magic here. Or first pack magic, not one pack. Awesome. I gotta open up more Silver Tempest, but hopefully that, I think that will come as... I mean, it's a new set, so still have so much time. We got water energy, we got the Dany, Quadstone, that looks like a sick shuriken, more Peko, we got Dewbiter, Ponyta, Venonat, Ralts, Spinda, we got a reverse Glalie, High <laughs> we got another Lugia V-Star first pack magic, let's go. I pulled this actually in our first Silver Tempest opening of uh, the Elite Trainer boxes, but so still that I actually was able to pull another one and I got this guy upside down let's flip the podium over there boom Lugia to start that's a good sighting and good news hopefully let's keep that pack magic going in our second pack here awesome awesome I'm excited actually too I know that there's a Paldea set collection boxes are coming out uh, I want to be able to open up more of those as well once they do come. I think they come in December or maybe Jan January 6th, I believe. Ponyta, Venonut, Dewbiter, Spinda, a reverse Spinrek hiding a non hollow rare Zera Aura. Not bad. But I think there's so many products coming out very soon. I know that there's the Paldea collection, there's Crown Venom, that's pretty neat. There's so many products I see leaking out. There's like those uh, Galarian Bird tins, there's the Lee Trainer boxes with Lucario in it. Pretty hype, I can't wait to get my hands on those guys. We got some Flora, Primordial Altar, we got Smeargle, Vesper, Dratini, Chinchu, Meditite, Attilo. Hiding a non hollow rare Delphox. Thick artwork. Some of my chase cards for Silver Tempest is actually going to be the two Rayquazas in the trainer gallery. As well as the. Oh no, I messed this up. But, as well as the 
altar i mean i think altar any of them especially the luby of course he's not gonna have that as one of their cheese cards uh but also i like the full art works you know those are pretty neat i want a whole artwork or full artwork that would be nice you know stick gym trainer smeargle lipton petillo chinchu pharaoh seed a reverse haunch girl i think a rare hollow rapid ash oh i'm sick so i think this was one of those cards that were available in those build and battle decks so hopefully if i get more we end up getting one of those guys as well awesome awesome Boom. let's see we got dark energy here we got fletchinder playing emergency jelly we got a fennekin spinnerack a beldum krogunk Lotus, are we able to get a trainer gallery? No, a reverse sandile hiding a non hollow rare melodic. Melodic? Melodic. I'm digging that premier ball actually. I'm so glad. Like the Pokemon Go product for me for TCG. Pretty cool. I know it's like a small set, but I like the artwork that you get in it, especially with the Radiant. Radiant Blastoise, Radiant Charizard, and the Radiant Venusaur. For me, the Radiant Venusaur looks so sick. And don't get me wrong, the Charizard's fire, but that Venusaur, I never loved Venusaur that much. <laughs> Let's just say that. But I'm so glad I got that Rainbow uh, Mewtwo. That was a pretty cool pull. Pikachu, got no bat. Pokemaru, a reverse Ariados hiding a non hollow rare Victini. Oh man. Are we going to get another pull? I would love that Regidrago alternate artwork. That's pretty neat. Damn, what's your guys' favorite like artwork here or case card for Silver Tempest? Let me know down below. I want to know what you guys are into actually. Altaria, we got Lance, Dreepy, Banpi, Fletching, Fletchling, Chim Chimeko, Bebas, a Reverse Wallace, Hiding. Ooh, a Hollow Rare Dragonite. I love that they brought back Dragonite like this. Like, simple. I don't know, like, look at that. He's just chilling in the clouds like that. That's so sick. That's very sick. Let's put you with the other hollow. How many packs do we got? We got five packs left. Let's pull some heat here. All right. Pull card. One, two, three, four. Let's go with fire energy. No electric. We got plus hello sand. Matang, we got Ferrisode Girl, we got Fletchling, we got Meditite, Dewbiter, Ponyta, Venonat, Emolga Reverse, hiding a non hollow rare Clink Clank. I don't like that Pokemon. <laughs> I'm just gonna say, I don't know why. I get the weird vibes every time I hatch that Pokemon in Pokemon Go, but uh, I've seen that too many times. Oh my god. Awesome, awesome. Boom. Anything you guys want to see, like maybe like me opening up, I can take a look at it as well. See where I can find it for cheap, to be honest. And make a video out of it for you guys. Fampi, Ndidi, Mar Rina, Marini, Stunfist Reverse, hiding a hollow rare area dose. We're getting quite a bit of hollows actually here. But yeah, speaking of like different packs to open up, I kind of want to be able to open up, uh, what you call it? those stacking tins those new ones with like charizard there's like a fire dark as well as fighting you get ombreon in the dark with like guzzlord that looks pretty cool i think i might be ordering some of those get those opened up for you guys as well as there's that new collector chest actually with like the origin form diaga and palkia i think it's like five packs in those we got tarot rat or tarot cat dragonair venomoth we got zubat l gym i think there's something hiding in here Boongus, Sandy Gas, Alucha, Reverse Metang, Psych, hiding a non hollow rare Arcanine. We're down to our last two. Are we able to pull some magic? So far, that Lugia is just holding everything together, but I would love an, at least another V or anything like that. That would be nice. Even a trainer gallery, we haven't seen one today yet. We got Green Energy, we got Dragonair, we got Toxicroak, we got Jinx. We got Snow Run, we got Sandile, 
Murkro, Fennekin, Beldum hiding in reverse Palosand, and a non hollow rare version. Verizion. What's with my words today with pronouncing these Pokemon? Jeez. Alright, Lugia artwork for the last pack. Let's pull another Lugia. Honestly, even that Lugia full art would be nice. We got a code card here for you guys. I think uh, Lugia like card itself is actually a playable card in the TCG world so far. So not bad if you guys are definitely like looking to play that game. Curlia, Fennekin, we got Spinarak, we got Beldum, Krogunk, Solosis, Reverse Wallace, hiding a non hollow rare Cobalion. What a pull. Alright, let's go ahead and take a look at our recap. Alright, here's a recap of the pulls that we got today. We are starting off with Ariados, we got Rapidash, and look at our Dragonite, he's just chilling in the air like it's normal for everyone to be doing that. It's not. And last but not least, we got Lugia V Star, first pack magic, by the way. However, I did wish we had a better finish to this opening like how we started. But again, you win some, you lose some. And hopefully, you guys have better pull rates. Let me know down below for today's question of the day is what's your chase cards and have you guys pulled it yet? Let me know down below. And stay tuned for more videos. Please like, share, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace. Wow.